stay a while and listen. Hello, welcome to the Freak Show. Bumpy McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I start up my early access coverage of Starpoint Gemini 3. It is by Little Green Men Games, and it released into Steam Early Access on September 5th, 2019. This might be just a one-off episode for now. It might be a comeback to down the road once there's like big patches. I might do a mini series. I don't know. That's always kind of the the up in the air for the early access coverage of a game. I sometimes play a lot more than others. It really depends. Either way, I've been having a blast with several other, well, we'll say space sim games, and I've been kind of a fan of the Starpoint Gemini series as a whole. And I'm ready to see what the latest and greatest is. Assuming it is the greatest. We're about to find out. Uh, we can do free roam or campaign. I sort of want to do this, but at the same time, I'm always I'm always a sucker for the campaign. Enter the cockpit of Captain Jonathan Bold. And get ready for a space adventure as you complete the story campaign. Fasten your seatbelt. Your journey is about to begin. Alright. Let's begin this journey, guys and gals. Are you with me? No? Well, then you can be sad because I'm dragging you along anyway. Alright, let's get this done. Three. We're just playing three, guys and gals. I lied. All the other stuff. This is just three. It's a number three. That's the name of the game. It's fine. It uh, loaded the 60% real fast. And, ah, here we go. And then not much after that. It, it's coming. It's slowly getting... There it is. Alright. What doth we have here? Ooh, shiny. Um, Captain Bold? Yes, I am. What is it, ship? I have a name, what? sir. And moods, apparently. Okay, alright. What is it, Ada? Mm, yes. Thank you, Captain Bold. Now, I have some doubts regarding our location. Oh? What kind of doubts? The worst kind, Captain. The Sea of Sorrow is an uncharted area full of pirates and other assorted scum and villainy. Precisely who we're looking for, and precisely who we want to join. Wh what? We do, sir? Did we vote on that? Don't be silly, um... Ada. As if you'd ever vote against your captain. Oh, okay. Oh boy. I'm going to be trying a controller, I think, for the first time. Left trigger to lock onto the waypoint. Oh, okay. Okay, whoa. Alright. Learn some new tricks here. L3 to boost. Really a massive fan of boost being on L3, but that's okay. It's kind of the norm, so. Whoa. Ooh, this... Alright, hold on. This might have to change. I... Uh, I'm gonna have to invert the axis eventually. I'll, I'll try to get through it this time around, but I'm gonna have to invert it. When I push up, I should be going down. When I push down, I should be going up. If I'm in a space sim. We're being hailed, Captain. We've been noticed. Uh-oh. Or... Of course, Ada. Good? I arranged this rendezvous. Did you? When, sir? Why? And with whom? The cloaked with ship the of doom. most delicious buccaneer you ever laid your eyes on. But I don't have eyes, sir. I have sensors. Ravenna huh. Black. Ravenna Black, Black, sir? The daughter of Corvus Black? The blackest, sir? Yes. The most charming. And bloodthirsty. And beautiful. Pirate alive? <laughs> that she is. Hello, Ravenna, my dear. It is I, Bold. Jonathan, uh, I have doubted you'd show up. What? Why is everybody doubting me today? Where did you meet her, sir? And why are we here? Good questions. <laughs> Three nights ago in a tavern on Lunai. She recognized my qualities right away and asked me to meet her here. I feel like Where are you, my love? This is going to go Close, bad. My love. You can never be too careful in my line. Did you come alone? 
As if I would share you with anyone, my orchid of the vacuum. Or orchid oh, of the Jonathan. vacuum? Uh, you're more of an airhead than I've been told. You can say that again. Uh, wait, what? Wait, could you say that again? Ship Captain Bold. Three ships, Captain. Three pirated ships armed to the teeth. Be consistent, Ada. If you don't have eyes, they can't have teeth. Uh, Ravenna, <laughs> what's the meaning of this, my love? Money, my love. I'm sorry to say, but as much as I love you, oh, I love money more. Well, this but seems bad. I don't have any money. Huh, that's true. Uh, Jonathan, love, you are made of money. Oh, well, yeah? I am? Sweet. He is. There is a bounty out for you. Uh-oh. More money than I ever dreamed about. Somebody wants you. And somebody wants you bad. Somebody wants me bad? Ooh, did you hear that, Ada? I feel uh, like... Miss Ravenna, did you say somebody wants him bad or... dead? Alive, unfortunately. Uh, oh. That's why I haven't oh. iced him in that tavern. Now, Jonathan, love, will you make it easy for me and surrender? Surrender, Jonathan. They have us outgunned. Think of me. Uh. Well... It depends. Depends on what? Who is it that wants me? Some girl, Rosa Stamatina. I think she wants to marry you. Sweet. Rosa St Oh, screw that. No deal. <laughs> Captain? She's filthy rich, Jonathan. It can't be that bad marrying someone that rich. She only wants me for my name. No deal, Ravenna. We fight. Be reasonable, Jonathan. We fight. This seems like a really bad idea. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, I forgot everything I knew about everything. Oh, this is such a bad idea. Don't don't have me do things. I think I have any idea what I'm doing. I, I do, but not really. Yeah, look at that. I, I hit a ship slightly for a couple of seconds. Now I'm I, I'm not sure what I'm doing. What's happening? Who's on first? Hey, buddy, what's going on? Great to be my friend. Yeah, Good look at that. Friends. Mad skills all up in a mad abundance. Oh god. I'm just gonna rub my ship across this thing. It's gonna be fine. Oh god. Oh god. I'm so bad at piloting this. Well, I oh. I do love and oh god. I do enjoy uh, learning new control schemes. That is one thing that I absolutely love and adore. Okay, so now that I've done that oh there's more. Alright. Give me a minute. I, I don't know if this is gonna help oh no. Oh I can't change settings while I'm here. Well, I guess that's Hey uh, what the hell is going on? About time! We are heavily outmatched, sir. May I suggest we run and hide? Come on, we can take them. We cannot, sir. It's only a matter of time before we explode. <laughs> ah, fine. We're just, they're gonna just let us go? I feel like we're not the fastest ship. Whatever. I kind of killed one well, and then I did a lot of wrong things after that. Again, I... I'm only going to partially blame, because it's absolutely not true, but I'm only going to partially blame the control scheme being the wrong up-down Y-axis. Yeah. It needs to be inverted for me in uh, Space Sims, though almost everything else it has to not be inverted. I know, I'm weird. I can't help it. Make this easy and surrender. Just everybody wants to kill me today, don't they? Alright, well. You're dead, I think. Probably also dead. That was easy. Woohoo! That was a great fight. Wasn't that a great fight, Chip? Ada. Ada. Yeah. Whatever. Okay, wasn't that a great fight? Ada. Ada. Please define great, Captain Bold. We lost half of everything. That's half fun. the shields, half the engines, and half of the supplies. But none of our spirit. <laughs> yeah, like that's worth anything. Come on, Ada. We're alive. 
Shouldn't that count for something? Technically, Captain, only you are alive. I'm an autonomous command module, overlaid by a supposedly amusing personality. You are a sweetheart, Ada. Mildly amusing. If you were a person, I'd marry Please you. Please don't say stuff like and that. And yet you just literally fought to avoid a marriage. Ah, well, that's a long story. Oh, yeah? yeah, but with only half the engines, we have twice the time. Not a very interesting story. Well, it must be more interesting than this introduction. Uh, you nice. really want to know? Yeah, if pirates are going to chase us because of it. Yeah, I guess you're right. She seems like a belligerent You know who Thomas ship. Scott is? The Thomas Scott? The late Thomas Scott? Big kahuna of Nexus Scientificum? Only nope. the most important person in the whole Gemini system? Never heard of him. The very same. Well, I'm his grandchild. Ah. One of his grandchildren, really. There was 16 of us last week. Wait, what? An ominous use of the past tense there. Yeah. Grandfather's death kind of tossed Nexus into a heritage war. Factions within factions within factions. Each one trying to secure someone from Scott's bloodline is proof of its legitimacy. Okay. And eliminating those that cannot be secured? Yep. Nine of my cousins killed. I even liked some of them. Uh. The rest are more or less prisoners of the warlords. Hmm. And you? I decided to bolt. Politics are not my game. I borrowed a ship. Huh. Me. You were the best looking one. Thank you. Yeah, before I halved in size. And the girl? Ravenna? No, the other one. Rosa? Oh. Rosa's the head of Nexus's hard science division. An important faction who has no Scott of its own. So she decided to marry you? So she decided to marry me. Why? I might have wooed her a little once. When I was drunk. <laughs> ah. Eh. Ah. Okay, back to the task, Captain Bold. What's the plan? I could use a drink. Yeah, me too. We're running on fumes. Uh, Any place close where we could, uh, refuel? What do the maps say? There's a ship we lost them, sir. The relevant half, at least. I have the proximity scanner running. It will let us know when it finds something. I can see It'll something. Beep. It'll beep. It'll be. It'll be. Oh, it yeah. beeped. It did indeed. A human-made structure within range, Captain. Can you get us there? With my eyes closed, Captain. You don't have the eyes. You don't have. Well, those are very easy to close, sir. That's, that's true. Oh, look. Press. All right. Oh, oh hold R three. Oh, what is cruise flight? On? Wait, what's that? That's Sakara Station, Captain Bold. Fuel, a dry dock, everything one could wish for. Uh -huh. Well, that's great, isn't it? Well, Multiops owns it, which means they'll charge you a heart and soul for even being there. Won't they settle for some spirit? Yeah, no. Probably not. I'm gonna say probably not gonna settle for some, you know what, it's fine. Well, this is definitely a different control scheme. Oh. oh. It does feel effortless though. Uh I should probably start thinking about how to actually dock. Uh-huh. Let's press Y to dock at the station. Okay. Is it, is there a problem that I'm like upside down? Yeah, no, that's that's fun. That's how you dock. You fly upside down. It's, it's not a big deal. Here I am, totally manually landing the craft. Hmm. I have an idea, Captain. That does. I'm all ears. Still confidence. We'll moor into the dry dock. I'll download myself into the drone, sneak into the best ship I can find, and overtake its control. Wait, what? You're going to steal a ship? No, I am going to steal a ship. You go and get yourself a drink while you wait for my call. Oh, and Captain. Yes? Please, don't woo anyone if you get drunk. She seems jealous. What? 
Be still my beating heart. What is this? I get to control a drone. Oh, that's not okay. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. I like the presentation so far, and if I can get the controls down, I think I'm really going to have a blast with this. You can't strafe? That feels wrong. Oh god. What the heck was that eyeball thing? I'm hacking terminals! Yeah. Is I already in the, the, the shipyard thing? Like, why am I doing this? I mean, I'm not, I'm not really complaining, I'm just slightly confused. Well, at least it's given me a little bit of a chance to kind of learn how to steer my ship. I mean, it's fine. Move left and right, right and left. Alright. There's no boost. Ooh. She has no guns. Oh, she's useless. I'm kidding. Meanwhile, at the bar. How's the hunting going, my dear AI companion? Give me a exit ramp. ASAP or sooner. ASAP or sooner. Hmm. That sounds promising. Go! Oh wait, now I control this goober? What was that? Ooh, this looks fancy. Or maybe it doesn't. I, I can't tell. I have no basis for knowing what's good or bad. Wow, here. I have to hand it to you. This is a very nice ship. Okay, it's a very nice we'll ship. We'll admire it later. We have to go. Hmm. I believe I forgot to pay for my drink. And I believe that's the least of our problems. We should probably leave. That's my guess. Oh, we do. Oh, Ada. Yeah? You sound uncharacteristically exuberant. I can't help it, Captain Bolt, sir. This is a dream ship. She's gonna the make ship us I cute. was always meant to be. Well, I'm happy for you, Ada, but can you please stop the barrel roll? Please? Aileron roll, but it's fine. <sighs> Thank you. Any sickness you might have felt was strictly psychosomatic, Captain. The intravehicular gravity pull was unchanged. Uh, which can't be said for my intratestinal gravity. <laughs> oh, oh. Lovely. Are we safe, Ada? Safe? Safe from what, Captain? Um, from the guys this ship belonged to? From Multiops Corporation? Well, I masked the ship's ID signature, but... Safe? <laughs> you must be kidding, Captain. Must I, Ada? How much do you know about Multiops, sir? No. Well, I've seen them around. They sell things, buy things, produce things. <laughs> things. And, um... Other, other things? things? You've led a pretty sheltered life, haven't you, sir? I have. I guess I have. If trade is the glue of every society, then Multiops is the super glue of human society. Fun. You can find them wherever there's a buck to be made. And if there is no buck to be made, they're thinking of the way to make it. Okay. In other words, they're everywhere, Captain Bolt, sir. You can never be entirely safe from them. What made you ah, decide see. to um, steal Ada? from them? Yes, sir. Why did you steal one of their ships then? Why not a ship of some meager and consequential coward? Yeah. Because it was so beautiful, sir. So elegant, so swift. So powerful. Right. Okay, great. We'll get ourselves killed in the most elegant ship you could find. Is that what you're telling me? Pretty much, yeah. Maybe seems we right. won't get killed right away, sir. I feel better already. Sweet. I'll hit you so hard oh. you won't need a tea gate. Okay. I got switch weapons, huh? Oh, a little bit of lag. A little, little bit of lag spiking there. I 
that did not go how I ah it's so backwards to me. Dance the dance of life, let's do it. Woo! That did some damage. Yeah, when you lock onto the targets, it's much easier to kill them. Great, just what I needed. What's that? This sucks! That's well, isn't this what you wanted, sir? A life of an outlaw? A life of an outlaw, yes. Not necessarily the death of an outlaw. Oh, we did they fine. often come as a set, sir. You know that supposedly amusing personality of yours, Ada? <laughs> I do. Sir? Less amusing by the minute, Ada. Right you are, Captain Bold. Would you like to hear an idea, Such sir? disdain. An idea how to make more enemies, I presume? Sorry to disappoint, sir, but no. There might be a way out. A temporary one, at least. I'm listening. Yes. The Gemini system is too hot for us, right? Here we have to avoid Nexus Scientificum and all of its factions, the bounty hunting pirates, and now the multi-ops. Uh-huh. I made all those enemies in, what, three days? You're simply amazing, Captain. <laughs> Thank you, Ada. The Gemini is out. The solar system's no better. It's lousy with multi-ops there. The only possible safe haven is. Don't say serious system. The serious system. But oh, you never listen, do you? What's wrong with Sirius, sir? There are aliens there. Those weird, long-faced ones. <laughs> the Dogons? Are you specious, sir? Specious. I'm not specious. They just look weird. Don't worry, sir. Everybody's a little bit specious. The important thing is that there is no Nexus and almost no multi-ops there. However... I just knew there was going to be a however. Or but... However, the only way there is through the star point, which is Nexus owned. So are we cooked? Not necessarily, sir. We are in a multi op ship. Chances are, multi ops hasn't communicated a theft this small to Nexus yet. So we're not cooked? Not necessarily, sir. We still have to pay for the transit. Okay. So we are cooked after all. Come on, man. Not necessarily, sir. There is a cloud of hypercharged cargon up ahead. That should do nicely as a payment. Ada. Sir? How about you do that cargon thing? And I go puke. Each according to his ability, eh, sir? Don't be cheeky, Ada. I think that's literally her name. Ada Cheeky Ada. Alright, I gotta do a thing, huh? Alright. Oh, that's... Nope. That's not what I wanted to do. All right, got it all over it. Totally know what I'm doing. I feel like my X button doesn't do what it... Oh, did I just cut my engine? Did. How do I fire fire the missile? Oh, I, I can slightly strafe with the okay. That's interesting. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know how to switch weapons. It's, it's fine, I'm sure. Go into the gas pocket. And open. All right, man. Let's, let's do this. Extract cargon gas from the gas pocket. It is done. We, I think. Okay, I did the thing that they wanted me to do. Now we're gonna go here. Oh, press B to open the in-game menu. Then inventory to see what items are in your cargo hold. Yeah, I feel like my controls do not work the way they say that they're supposed to work. Does that start? I may have to play around with some settings for my controller because I feel like 
it's not working. Chances are what's happening is it's running two instances of the controller, and it, just don't worry about it. Don't worry about the technical de details, guys, and or gals. What am I doing here? Cargan, okay. Okay, I was able to back out. Still can't seem to change what weapon. Yeah, 100% cruise. there. Had a good cleansing, Captain. In my personal top five. Are we anywhere, Ada? Starpoint Gemini is in view, sir. Nice. I'll unmask the ID signature for the moment, and you should hail the gatekeeper. Right. Starpoint Gemini, Starpoint Gemini. This is Captain Quilt of MO47 DKW speaking. Please respond, Starpoint Gemini. Captain Quilt? Shut up. That was my nickname on dating apps back in the day. <laughs> dating apps? Jeez. Shut up. Yes, MO47 DKW. Go ahead. Requesting the rite of passage. <sighs> there are ships ahead of you. Might take a while. Where do you want to go? Solar? No, serious. Serious? <laughs> Seriously? Not many multi-ops traffic in that direction. What's the occasion? Um... Um? A, a delivery? Um, a delivery. Yeah. Delivery? In a gunship? What are you delivering? Toothpicks? <laughs> a team of basketball playing fleas? Uh, nice. Um, no. The Towers of Cabona. The Towers? You mean the show? Yeah, the commander of the Magellan Refinery is a huge fan. We're bringing him the entire new season. Really? Uh, wouldn't it be easier to stream it? You'd think so, right? But no, when it comes to inter-system travel, it's apparently more cost-efficient to piggyback it than to stream. Hmm. That's weird. Okay, MO47TKW. You are eighth in the outgoing lane. Prepare the payment. Starpoint Gemini out. Interesting. My, my, Captain Bold. You are quite an accomplished liar. Captain liar. Quilt, thank what you. What can I say? All those years on those dating apps. Ouch. That's, that's rough. Captain Quilt speaking, MO47 DKW. Captain Quilt? I knew an idiot with such a nickname once. Oh, no. <gasps> Ravenna? What are you doing here? Following the trail of calamity to my bounty, of course. Will you surrender peacefully this time, my love? Uh, I can't. I... Oh, don't be silly, Jonathan. Keep yourself up. Get married. Bring the war for Nexus to an end. <laughs> Make me rich. Ada, seems... how swift is this ship? As swift as it's elegant. What do you have in mind? We go to the star point now. No waiting, no paying, no nothing. Can we do it? There's a 50-50 chance we won't end in serious, Captain. Can we do it? You pilot. I'll fire. Ooh. Ravenna. Yes, my love. Here's your answer. Oh no. What? You can't do that. Yeah, well, he did. Well, she did. Uh, so see, we're out of here. Oh god. Oh god. Uh MO47DKW uh, uh, you can't do that. I know. I'm really bad at it. I'm so sorry. Whoa! I didn't think I could do that. I di I didn't. I, I did really bad. Yet. Oh we, don't Why? say that. We're in, aren't we? But not out. Oh god. You know what, guys and girls, I think maybe maybe we'll We'll pause. We'll break off the episode right here. I think this is a good spot to leave you cliffhanged and uh, curious and confused and scared, just like I am in all things here. Um, yes, yes! 
Who's the greatest pilot of them all? Aw, we made it. There's no way to pass. Is universally acknowledged as the most accomplished Boy. pilot of the last 200 years. I mean of the living ones. Glenn Curacao? I meant in this ship. Hmm. Let me think. Ada. Ah, you won't spoil my mood. I just jumped systems, saved my bacon from the Pirate Queen, and now? And now? Yes? Well, now I can do whatever I want. Uh -huh. Sounds great. What are you going to do? Um, something? Sure. Fascinating, Captain Bold. And when do you plan on doing something? Soon? You are such a pain in my propulsion, Ada. The Tomorrow, next week, in a month. What does it matter? Well, it matters slightly, Captain. Our fuel is rather low. Really? We were full five minutes ago. Hot wheeling through a star point does come at a price. <sighs> wait, wait. What about the cargon we collected recently? Unrefined cargon, Captain. Well, let's refine it then. The Magellan refinery is here somewhere, isn't it? We shall take a stolen multi-ops vessel to a multi-ops refinery and show them a load of cargon illegally collected on the other side of Star Point. The passage through which we haven't paid for? That is a bold plan, Captain Bold. Stop being so belligerent. Yeah, well, do you have a better one? Or would you like to call Glenn Curacao, perhaps? Oh, please, Captain. I just wanted to point out that you're an outlaw now. So not every option is open to you anymore. Okay, fine. Who needs options? We'll be outlaws and we'll do outlaw things. Which are... Um... Scavenging, stealing, smuggling, illegal mining... Sounds good oh, to me. That sounds suspiciously like work. Any chance for... I don't know, some light piracy? Light piracy. Piracy is for the big boys, Captain. <sighs> and girls. And Ravenna Black, yes. <sighs> All right, Ada. Find us something to scavenge then, will ya? All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to do it for this, uh, this first episode of our, I guess, early access coverage of Starpoint Gemini 3. Hope you guys enjoyed. I had, a, I had a lot of fun hearing the story. I will fix my control scheme and everything else for the next time around. You never know until you hop into a game what you need to change, what you don't need to change. So it is what it is. Um, yeah, I had a blast with the game. I think it's a lot of fun. Um, story's a little bit weird. The characters grew on me. I was a little unsure at the start. I'm like, this guy's kind of a... And she's a little... But you know, I, I like it. I think it's good. Oh, right, if you guys want more information about the game, where to get the game information on the developer, or any of that wonderful fun stuff, it'll all be down below in the description of the video in various links and things of that nature, just like it always is. Subscribe to the channel, guys and gals. It helps out tremendously. Uh, again, I have like an 80% people who watch the channel aren't subscribed type thing going on, so I'd like to try to lower those numbers if possible. And then have maybe like a 50-50 or maybe like everybody who watches is subscribed. That would be cool. And yeah, I'm going to stop saying subscribe. So, till the very next episode, folks, my name's Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show, and I will see you later. <laughs>